What you could call the hidden city of Huntington County has now resurfaced because of the drought. Monument City has been underwater for almost 50 years to make way for Salamone Lake. But with the water receding now, parts of the old city are starting to become visible again. News Channel 15's Lamar Holiday set out to see the old town, and he joins us from Studio 15 with what's out there. Well, Mark and Heather, I can tell you it was definitely a sight to see. You can see where some buildings used to stand and even drive down some of the old roads like I did today, which brought people young and old to see what used to be Monument City. What usually sparkles, at least underwater, isn't always gold, but in this case, it's an old city that's in the spotlight. It is a very nice location. It's very beautiful here. It's the first time I've saw it, and it's a pretty neat experience. Remnants of buildings, old trees, and even roadways that would be under the Salamone Lake are now clear to see. The city is even visible from the bridge off of State Road 105. This is what used to be Monument City. The DNR says the city was bought by the Army Corps of Engineers and torn down in 1965 to create the Salamone Reservoir. Jeff Turner brought his family to see the history of a town that went under. Just something to see, see what was here and the different types of foundations that was used. Around this time last year, it would have been very difficult to drive down this very road. That's because the DNR says this would have been at least eight feet underwater. To bring the current lake level back up to that point would probably require about five to six inches of rain. But until that happens, the city will become like some fish because of the drought out of water. Harrington says they don't mind people coming by to see the city, but he says no one is allowed to pick up any artifacts that they find. In Studio 15 tonight, Lamar Holiday, News Channel 15.